realize this moment may not be the most convenient for a heart to heart. There was a time. Standing on the 51st landing, counting the initial ground level landing. 
DH-432 is estimated to be 200 meters below the initial platform. 34 minutes have elapsed. The volume of crying has not increased. I'm feeling a little uneasy. You spent a long time in a dark, unknown stairwell. It's natural. Please continue. The subject hesitates before stepping down on the next stair. As the subject moves forward, the flood lamp illuminates a face located approximately at the bottom of the flight, SCP-087-1. It appears to be the same size and shape as a human head, except it is lacking a mouth, nostrils, and pupils. The face is completely motionless, but is making direct eye contact, indicating its awareness of D-8432. Fuck? What the fuck is that? Holy shit. What the fuck? Can you please describe what you see? It's, uh, it's some sort of fucking person face thing. It's fucking looking right at me. Fuck? What the, it's fucking looking right at me. Is it moving? No. It's just staring at me. It's fucking creepy. Please approach and further illuminate the entity. Fuck. Man, I don't want to fucking do shit. D-8432 reaches the ground floor in 18 minutes at which time he collapses and passes out. There is no sign of SCP-087-1. Review of the footage indicates an equal number of flights and steps ascending as descending. Audio of the crying and pleading remains at the same volume until the last flight, at which point it ceases. Medical reports indicate collapse was a result of the rapid ascension of the stairs, causing fatigue. happening to you, but I'm in the same boat. So listen up. You guys are not the first team that I've sent out against this thing, but you will be the last. And trust me, I mean that in the best way possible. Project SCP-895, also known as Camera Disruption. The following footage I'm about to show you is confidential. I stole it from the record room. It's about two weeks old. Give or take. I don't know. I never look at the calendar anymore. All right. Object SCP-895. Object class, Euclid. Uh, er, I'm gonna call it a Euclid, I guess. Why not? Social Circuit 895 is sealed and closed and stored in an isolated underground containment cell at a depth of approximately 100 meters. No cameras, microphones, or other surveillance equipment may be brought within a 10-meter red zone radius of SCP-895 without express permission from at least two Level 3 personnel. Any on-site personnel exhibiting unusual behavior or signs of psychological trauma are to be screened immediately and removed from the site or terminated if a situation warrants. This goes back to the be careful what you do because being terminated basically means being shot in the face thing. Description. SCP-895 is an ornate oak coffin recovered from the mortuary by SCP personnel on... Following reports of unusual footage captured by the surveillance equipment installed at that location. When questioned, mortuary staff weren't able to determine the source of SCP-895 and how it was transported to the location. Upon attempting to open SCP-895, agents on location found the object empty. However, observers viewing the live camera feed were... SCP-895 causes disruption in video and photographic surveillance equipment within 50 meters similar to vivid, disturbing hallucinations with variable duration and regularity corresponding to the camera's proximity to 895. Within a range of 5 meters from 895, footage captured can cause severe psychological trauma and hysteria in those subjects. These disruptions do not extend to observers physically present within the area. The following audio is a recording of the last endeavor one of my teams undertook under my lead. We were ill-prepared, and my team suffered the consequences. One, command. All civilians have been detained and evacuated. You are clear to move in and capture. Command, one lead. Roger, we are moving in. We are inside the lobby. VOD, check. Team one, command. We are receiving... We are seeing blood on the wall. Please confirm. Negative, command. It's clean in here. Nothing out of the ordinary. It's gone. Team one, advise mimetic properties in effect? Copy command. Team 1 moving into storage area. We are in the storage area. Object located. Christ, it's moving. Team 1, confirm object appears to be alive and moving. 
negative. We see no movement. Object appears to be normal. Empty. The object appears to be empty. Command, do you copy? Command, do you copy? We're bugging out. Close that thing. Following incident and the loss of three personnel, the red zone of SCP-895 has been extended from 5 meters to 10 meters, and the security personnel shifts have been receded to four hours as a precaution. I can't tell you exactly how this is going to help you with 682, but I can promise you that it will help you. Get some rest tonight. You're going to need it for what you're about to have to do. Just keep calm, use my advice, and remember, smile for the camera. Do shut up. There we go. Now, those of you who are watching this, this is what happens when you steal. You pay a dire consequence. Also, a little reminder for you don't go into. What was that thing called? SCP. What was it? What was it called? Let me see here. I'm going to get the footage again. Just pretend I keep forgetting this thing. SCP-895 Also for the coffin Now a little warning For those of you who wish to go into the coffin You might suffer a terrible surprise You know, I'm surprised the SCP Foundation is not taking away my phone camera And this camera's not mine And whose is it? Oh yes, the girl just died now, if you'll excuse me, I have a little experiment to be done on her life. 